Tu ne l'as pas dit que tu n'as pas dit que tu n'as pas dit que tu n'as It is a winning vote that I've just cast and it gives me pleasure and much pleasure to know that I'm part of the big Hoima voice that has cast a vote today to decide on Hoima's leadership. The situation has come here and we believe, we believe that if it continues like this, we, wouldn't have, we won't have many hurdles and that is what is actually expected. Because there shouldn't be hiccups during voting. It is supposed to be a free and fair exercise where people freely express their will. I'm registered in Hoiba district, but I can't see myself anywhere to be voted. And I've been voting here. Thank you. So why, what, uh, is there any explanation? Have they explained to you why? They can't explain. They can't explain because everything is just confusing. For my case, Me as in the Gerema, I'm not. Because mm. really, the if you cannot vote for the person you want, for mm. God's sake, then why are we Ugandans? We are struggling to vote for the people we love. Like for the case of the other polling station. Me, I've been voting for the last three, three terms. Mm. That, that's 15 years ago. Then I got so much surprise when this I reached there. And these people could not verify me. Mm. I had my national ID. I had my voter location today. But still, the biometric refused me. I had to spagulu. I say, I told those people I'm going to vote. I cannot leave. I have my ID. You are my chairman. Don't you know me? I'm in the register. Why do you refuse me to vote? It was until when I insisted, that's when I was allowed. Which polling station is that? That is Hoima Mixed Polling Station in Parrot Division. Hoima Mixed Polling Station is went, near this church of I SDA. Went public. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I went which, public, which? Where I registered from, where I got my national ID from, they told me, go to the Boma Ground. I walked. The bomber ground, but still, 